Hello and welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another episode of TEW 2020 NXT 2010. And we are back today with our third pay-per-view special NXT TakeOver Fatal 4-Way. A stacked card to go through here. I'll kick off the show Dusty Rhodes. A little promo video just going over all the matches for 73. Also Dusty Rhodes announcing that the Cruiserweight title is officially vacated. And Neville and Hawkins will be fighting to crown a new champion later tonight before we kick things off with the women's tag team title match the champions Daphne and Paige defend their gold for the first time against the team of AJ Lee and Serena and in the end here your winners and still the NXT women's tag team champions are Daphne and Paige Daphne pinning AJ Lee after hitting her with a swinging fisherman's suplex as they make their first defense of their NXT women's tag team titles for a 38. Good match. Daphne was off her game, sadly. But, you know, still pretty good. Daphne, 41. Paige, 23. You know, Paige slowly building herself up here. Uh, as well as 33 for AJ Lee and 32 Serena. Both the challengers doing well as well, despite coming out on the losing end here. As Daphne and Paige keep a hold of their women's tag team championships. And then afterwards, we have some more tag team action. The NXT men's tag team titles, Fatal 4-Way match the rotunda brothers bray and Bo, are looking to defend their goals in a real family affair the, them of course brothers take on the young bucks the young bucks matt and nick jackson who are brothers of course as well as the briscoe brothers mark and jay and finally the usos jimmy and jay twin brothers as we all know so a real family affair for the xc men's tag team titles in fatal four way uh, the rotundas come out the Briscoes come out, the Young Bucks come out, the Usos do not come out yet. The music plays, but no one does come out. Eventually the music stops. And then you see the image of Abyss walking through the entranceway, dragging the bodies of Jimmy and Jay, who are just out cold. Abyss dragging them and then tossing them down the ramp towards the ring as Lou Copper walks behind him arms out wide smiling as him and abyss make their way to the ring uh, uh, luke harper standing up onto the apron and grabbing the tag rope abyss getting in the ring for action the usos dropping out of the match through we'll say no choice of their own here and luke harper and abyss take their place for a 34 good little pre-match segment here with a big change to the match and in the end maybe the change in Superstar, maybe the fact that they're Abyss and Luke Harper, and who would want to mess with them, Abyss and Luke Harper, are your new NXT Tag Team Champions. Abyss getting the pin onto Mark Briscoe, I think here, it's all back, as an elimination match, but it's, just, it's not, it's just a normal Fatal 4 Tag Team match. Abyss getting the pin on the Briscoe, and Abyss and Luke Harper picking up the NXT Tag Team titles for a 53. Good match here. Uh, ratings wise 65 abyss abyss smashing that out of the park 51 for matt and nick jackson 45 bray rotunda 46 jay mcbriscoe 44 mark briscoe 28 luke harper 27 Bo rotunda very happy with that another good match to keep the show going as we get our first new champions of the evening in the form of abyss and luke harper as next up we have the nxt north american title online in a fatal four-way match, Alberto Del Rio and his accomplice, I guess is the word, EC3, taking on two men who have been a thorn in Del Rio's side for a while now. The uh, somewhat unit they have been of Shinsuke Nakamura and Kazushika Okada, both looking for gold. Fatal four-way, Del Rio, Okada, Nakamura, EC3, in the end, your winner. And the new NXT North American champion, is Shinsuke Nakamura for a 49. Good match. Nakamura pinning EC3 with a Kinshasa in the end. Uh, 52 Del Rio, 56 Nakamura, 37 Okada, 15 EC3. Happy with this. Another good match. NXT TakeOver going really, really well so far as Nakamura gets the win. The referee raising his arm. Okada rolling out the ring. Del Rio ringside not happy. You can't believe it as Okada gets in the ring. And he hands the NXT North American title to Mac Nakamura. They shake hands. They show respect as Nakamura celebrates with his newly acquired North American Championship for a 58 here. 
uh, yeah, another really good match to show. Ticking along beautifully so far as we crown our second new champions of the night. Uh, and we're going to crown another new champion next because the NXT Cruiserweight Championship is on the line. Kurt Hawkins taking on Neville. The champion La Sombra having to vacate after Neville and Mesa Dryan shattered his knee. Unable to walk out of action for over a year now. La Sombra having to vacate the title of course. And Neville, having bragged about what he did, thought he deserved the title. Hawkins, as he has done so many times since NXT 2010 started here, thinking he deserves the next title. He deserves, as one of the most well-known people around here, to be a champion. And he'll have a chance here. Hawkins versus Neville for the NXT Cruiserweight title. You're in the end, your winner. And the new NXT Cruiserweight champion is Neville. Hitting the red arrow onto Kurt Hawkins. For the win, Neville, your new cruiserweight champion for a 37. Good match, 37 Hawkins, 22 Neville. No complaints on my end. Happy with this. As after the match, Neville raises his newly won tile in the air. Boss just in the background, kind of, you know, out of frame. You see Mason Ryan beating the ever-living hell out of Kurt Hawkins for daring to step up to Neville. For a 31, happy with this, Neville. Cruiserweight champion. And of the four title matches so far tonight, we have had three new champions, which doesn't bode well really for Karma and Wade Barrett, does it? Uh, but we're going to find out how it's going to go for Karma first of all, because we're going to see women's title match next. Fatal 4-Way, Karma, Bailey, Dakota Kai and Candice LeRae. Uh, LeRae, Kai and Bailey discovering the most recent episode of NXT that if they work together, they can take Karma down. They all three work together and they got Karma out of the ring, taking her down off her feet for the first time in her NXT career. If they can work together, you'd have to think they can get, take the title off Karma here tonight. And in the fate of Y match for the NXT Women's title, in the end, they give it all they got. They work together as much as you can when you all want to be NXT Women's champion before it slowly starts to fall apart, leaving way for Karma to storm home. And retain her NXT Women's title. Pinning Dakota Kai with an implant buster to retain the belt for a 39. Decent match. Happy with this. 52 Karma. 23 Candice. 20 Bailey, 20 Dakota. No complaints on my end as Karma retains her NXT Women's title over these three challengers. And then stands tall after the match. Dominant and still the champ for a 26. Before, it's time for the main event with the NXT Championship on the line. Wade Barrett, the inaugural champion, looking to make another defence. But can he? It is a tough challenge against the phenomenal one, AJ Styles, one of the best wrestlers in the world. The self-described best wrestler on the planet, Cesaro and Seth Rollins. Wade Barrett's toughest test yet, and in the end, in Fatal 4-Way, one of the things about Fatal 4-Way, commentators often say, comes into play, and that is that the champion does not need to be pinned, because your winner and the new NXT champion is the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. Pinning Seth Rollins after a phenomenal forearm in the end to win the gold for a 73. Really good main event, as you'd expect from these four guys. Really happy with that. 82 Styles, 55 Barrett, 49 Cesaro, 49 Rollins. Cesaro off his game, still getting 49, still doing really well. Got the crowd buzzing. What a way to end the show as afterwards AJ Styles celebrates your new NXT champion for a 72. Yeah, really good end to the show here, especially with this NXT championship program. AJ Styles and Wade Barrett especially doing really, really well. Happy with this as NXT TakeOver Fatal 4 Way overall gets... A 56, really good rating. The 56 overall. Four new champions in Abyss and Luke Harper, your tag champs. Nakamura, North American, Neville Cruiseway, and AJ Styles, your new NXT champion. Another really good pay-per-view special from NXT here in March now that I'm really happy with. And I hope you have been too. Going to make our speeches to AJ Styles, uh, Shinsuke, Nakamura, Ra. And Abyss did really well as well, actually. So we're just going to praise all three of these guys on a great performance. 
pleased I did AJ Lee instead of AJ Styles. I would never not make that mistake. Uh, but, you know, AJ lost, but, you know, she did fine. So you can have that as well. All pleased. And I am very, very pleased. And I hope you are too. If you are, then leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more updates on the series and more Turtle Extreme Wrestling 2020 content. And thank you for watching.